Hi. Hello, people. I'm going to do this rant today about something that made me mad yesterday. Oh, man. I really need to put some Vaseline on my lips. You know? And it took me yesterday until today to really kind of calm down about it. I mean, I'm still mad. I'm still mad about it. But, um, yeah. So, it has everything to do with a show that I really, really admire. And I respect Michael Savage. But I did not agree with how he treated one of the callers. And basically, so, I mean, it goes down like this. Like, okay, so the caller calls yesterday. And he's like, I agree with you with you saying that Flynn is a fall guy because Flynn is, you know. But the question that the guy asked about Palestine, I, I think it was like, how did Palestine become a state? The way that he asked it was was offsetting, you know, because it threw me through a loop at first, you know. And then I thought about it. I was like, oh, I know what he's talking about. And it's referencing Palestine as a country after the first Israel was destroyed. Okay. Now, Mr. Savage decided he wanted to sit up there and be like, well, what book are you reading out of a Nazi book? It's a more mess. And it's like, hold up. <laughs> hold up. And then you want to turn around and throw out God. I mean, yeah, God, that's that whole God thing is pushed by the Catholic Church. So that's, yeah. He, he didn't want us calling him that for a reason. And it's the association of idol worship and some more mess. Antihus and, and the gods that were, that have presented themselves way back when and some more stuff like the ones in Egypt, like Thoth and sh shit like that. Anyways, anyway, so yeah, you know, <laughs> But the way that, that Savage handled that, that call, I mean, instead of him trying to f understand what the caller was trying to say, he just basically bashes him. And it's like, hold up, this is a man who likes to sit up there flaunt and, and just be like, hey, I know all. I don't know, not know all, but I know a lot of shit. I'm a doctor, blah, blah, blah. Okay, if you know a lot of shit, if the, that being the case, that one, you never should have... You never should have handled that call the way that you did. Two, what he was referring to is the whole 12 tribes of Israel thing. Now, I'm I'm just going to do a brief overview thing or whatever, whatever about it. I'm not going to get into it, blah, blah, blah. Anyways, now, in the Bible, Yahweh said he's going to destroy uh, Israel twice. Twice. The first one was after the 12 tribes had left. Okay, well, he told uh, uh, the 12 tribes to go south into Africa, okay? Now, they decided to go north, east, where you got the Indians, because they went all the way east, crossed the Bering Strait, and went down through Canada. That's a long-ass walk. Anyways, <laughs> anyways, you know, they, you know... And then some of them went south, and that's part of where, where, where the, um... The slave trade came in because they, because the tribe of Judah went all the way over to the west. It's that area that they kidnapped that the Jews had sat, the fake Jews, the fake Jews that are right now currently in Israel, had put their money towards. Why? Because the Jewry religion, okay, the tribe of Judah, uh, um, Came up with the Jewry religion or something like that. Anyways. <laughs> Anyways. Um, yeah, so they were trying to kidnap them and basically wipe them out. And so some black folks over here who have no African connection over there. You know? Anyways. Which is part of my family. Yay. Louisiana. Anyways. Um... Yeah, both sides, Louisiana. 
<laughs> I just remembered that. <laughs> Realized that. <laughs> anyways. Anyways, so. Um, anyways. So, yeah. That was when the, the, the first time that the that Israel was destroyed. The first time. The second time is coming up now. And it's going to be destroyed because of the synagogue of Satan who claims that they're Jews. The Ashkenazi Khazars, they're fake Jews, a.k.a. fake Jews. Okay, are the ones sitting right now over there in Israel. No, 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 no. That are sitting right now in the forced Israel. Okay? And then Savage want to sit up there and... Be like, oh, well, there have always been Jews in, 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 in Israel. But hold on. If you know so much, you know a whole lot of shit, then you would know that after Israel was destroyed the first time, it was turned into Palestine. I mean, I mean, in somewhere I read, they even have the 12 de uh, descendants uh, blood in them too. I don't know how true that is. I never really... Looked too much into that. Anyways. Anyways. But yeah. Yeah. You know, so to just sit up there and pass it off. I mean. Leads me to believe that. That you may know a little something about it. But. I don't know if you don't want to get into it. Or you. Whatever. Whatever. And then on top of that. What I what I found odd. Is yesterday listening to that thing. Where, um, because he. He brought me back to, um, cause when, when Ned and shit, who said that whole thing about, uh, uh, a man from China is a, is Chinese or, <clears throat> or whatever, whatever other ones that he said afterwards. And then he sit up there and say that he comes up with, <laughs> I mean, <laughs> hold on. <laughs> first off, first off, first off, you know that your ass is a fucking Khazar Jew because if you would have sat up there and said, oh, well, we people in Israel are Israelites. That's because you know net and shit who you're not a motherfucking damn real Israelite. That's why you just fucking do with the fucking damn cover up of, of, of Judaism. Oh, oh, we're, we're, uh, I can't even, I can't even get it out. I'm sorry to get mad again. But yeah, yeah, talking about, oh, we're, um, <laughs> us in Israel are, are, are Jews uh, because of Judea. And it's like, what? You make no motherfucking sense. <laughs> but like I said, the only reason why you didn't motherfucking call yourself a motherfucking damn Israelite is because you know that you're not a real Israelite. And then on top of that, <laughs> to throw it off as Judah, to I I, I think it was a it was an indirect hit to the to to the tribe of Judah, you know, and <laughs> with some blasphemy bullshit like that, you know, and then and then you want to sit up there, excuse me, and talk about uh. About the Palestines don't have no right to that land. And it's like, hold the fuck on, homeboy. How you... You know what? And it reminded me, like I was telling my mom yesterday, it reminded me of how... <laughs> of how the United States was taking over. Yeah. Native American land first, and then all of a sudden the white folks come in, and it's like, oh! Oh, well... Hold up, it was white folks and Jews who were, because the Jews were trying to make this another one of their headquarters where they took the tribe of Judah to and they wanted to watch over the tribe of Judah and make sure that we are being, going down in population and size and stuff like that so they could claim that they're the real Jews and blah, blah, blah. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. Anyways, so yeah. Anyways, so I mean, and I know those those two things kind of kind of really struck me as really odd to come out of net and shit. Who's not? There's another one too. I I don't remember what it is, but um, <laughs> but um, yeah, 
the faith, the Jews that are right now in Israel are under the guise. I mean, I mean, they're 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 synagogue of Satan, synagogue of Satan, synagogue of Satan, right there. Those, <laughs> them right there, <laughs> and it's like it's like you, the you only reason why you did not come at it directly is because you know that your whole thing is a lie. Oh, you know it's a lie. Oh, let me go make my coffee. You know it's a lie. <laughs> it's a big ass lie. I'm gonna have my sandwich this morning. My sandwich. But anyways, you know, I just, uh, I just, yeah, but yeah, but my, my, my main point is, is Savage shouldn't have did that. Savage shouldn't have did that. And instead of cutting him down, try to understand to... You know so damn much, you would have known that what Net and Chit who said was a big ass fucking lie when it came down to them being fucking Israelites or them being the real Jews, and they're not. They're not. They come from fucking Turkey and 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 motherfucking Europe. They're they're the European Jews. Gosh, which consists of what? I think that it was a tribe of Gad, not Gad. Oh my gosh, I meant Dan. I meant Dan. Ah, uh, yeah, though, yeah, the exiled um one that was replaced. You know? <coughs> Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Uh. And the tribe of Dan turned into being the ones that are doing all the warlockery and witchery and some more mess. And then it just spread to other places. <sighs> oh, yeah. Yeah. And a nice fun fact. Nice fun fact. Why? 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 <laughs> I can't even say it right now. Why our freaking school books was teaching us that Hitler was a horrible person, a horrible human being. No, he wasn't. No, he wasn't. Yeah, he may have had his damn quirks with his, the whole science thing and wanting to talk to aliens and, or no, talking to aliens and getting technologies from them and blah, 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 whoop de whoop de whoop But, but, who is that? Oh, these people need to hurry with my damn phone. Anyways, but yeah. Hitler knew where the, rude, the the true and real Jews were. He knew where they were. But y'all realize that he was trying to go across Europe getting rid of the Jews. Getting rid of the fake Jews. Because he knew they was about to fuck shit up. And that's what they doing right now, y'all. I just want to say I do enjoy the Michael Savage show. He is awesome. I just wanted to correct on that and because I, I tried to call in and I couldn't get through. The first time I, I forgot the number as soon as I heard it. Then I called this other number from South Dakota, but it was like um, um, the listen telephone line thingy or whatever you want to call it. And I got mad and impatient with that, so I hung up <laughs> and I just tuned back into the show and just... You know, so I finally got the number. And so then the first time the fucking dude want to sit up there and be rude. Because I didn't I didn't totally grasp what he said. As soon as he picked up the phone, he was like, what do you want to say? And I was like, well, I want to say. And I was like, you know, it was like, wait, let me make sure. Sure. That's what he said. So. <laughs> so I asked him, what did you uh, did you ask me? What did I what did I want to say? He hung up. He hung up. I was mad about that for a minute because that was really fucking rude. I understand you got people back to back to back trying to uh, call the show and whatever, but don't be rude. Don't be a jackass. So then <laughs> I call a second time. Um, I went back to back like five or six times. I got through like the sixth or the seventh time. So, okay. 
we're on now. So then I get to explaining, you know, what it is that I wanted to say. You know, basically, I, you know, like I said before, I do, I do agree with him that Flynn is being used as an escape goat. Well, at that point in time, it was, and that the fact that he needs to take care of Trump needs to take care of home first before he starts flying out to every other fucking damn country. Well, going to meet them, phone. That's something different. But when you're going out and you're doing this with this country and blah blah blah, even though even though Ned and shit who came here, whatever. But it's it's just the fact that you just started, you know. Do something. I mean, do some more with, with with us here at home. But, you know, and I also have a problem, though, too, when it comes down, down to Trump. Like, like, like the law that has to do with, uh, like, what happened with, with the NDAA Act of this year and a little piece on uh, fake news and uh, those, I think it was, um, there's two other bills that we're trying to go through. I don't know if they got through, but if he decided to squash them in some more mess. Like, if you really are for us and you, you're you all about us and our freedom and listening to the realness and shit, do something about that too. You know, I mean, I understand he just got in, but I mean, it's like certain things that are immediate that Obitcha sat up there and fucked off on purpose that should have been taken care of. That's... You know, besides the ones that, that that he did, you know, with the executive order and blah blah blah. Okay, that that's 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 part of it. <laughs> that is only part of it, you know. <laughs> anyways. Anyways. But yeah, you know. And so then when I got to the part of me and what I really wanted to speak on, which is what I I just did the video on just right now. You know, cuz I started it <laughs> And I guess the guy knew where I was going. And he was like, oh, well, he's not taking any more calls right now. Then why the fuck did you let me motherfucking speak? You could have sat up there and been like, well, hey, he's not taking any more calls right now. Bye. Well, no, no. Be like, okay, well, you know, well, good afternoon, what, what it is that you want type of thing or whatever. And then, oh, well, he's not taking any calls right now. He could have did that, but he didn't rude just just rude gosh and you know and my my thing is is that i I understand i mean i I could take blunt people i can take it you know for the most part i am myself but i also know when to not be rude and some more mess you know you know that's why that's why right why i like umar too you know and I mean, I don't get offended by either one of them two. I don't get offended. But when it comes down to your 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 callers, I mean, well, kind of really, they could both use a little bit more tact and a bit more niceness, you know, just being a bit nice, just just a little bit, because you know that that call that that, that Michael had was just. Really, really out of pocket, you know, and how he handled it. I mean, I, I, I don't mind. Like I said, I don't mind you being rude and some more mess and not rude. No, no, I shouldn't say rude. I don't mind you being blunt and to the point and some more mess, but I don't know. Yeah. Anyways, I'm about to go enjoy my talk, my coffee. Talk about my, my Nigerian baby daddy and. Yeah, eat. Make my sandwich. My smamich. Woo! <laughs>